For this task, you'll need 22 quarters, 22 dimes, 22 nickels, and six dollar coins, as well as a flathead screwdriver. The first thing you want to do is make sure that your coin mech is unplugged and has no power connected to it. The next thing we'll need to do is set the price to twelve dollars. You'll do that by pushing down on these tabs here and pulling the head forward and out. Unplug it and set it aside. So here you'll see two sets of switches. The first set is our option switches. We won't be using those. And the second set of eight switches is our price setting. So to set the price to $12, you'll put all, each switch, one through eight, into the on position. The next thing you'll do is in the lower right corner over here, you'll see a set of pins. You may see two sets of pins, as you see here. If that's the case, the set that you'll be using are the upper set of pins right here. Now what we're going to do is temporarily short out the pins. I push the pins together so that they're touching and then insert the screwdriver in between the two pins. Next you'll plug your head back in and put it back into place leaving your screwdriver there. Then you'll connect the coin changer to power. You can do this by just plugging it back into your machine as long as your machine is connected to power. I'm going to be doing this using a vending tester. So once your coin mech is connected to power, you'll leave your screwdriver in place for a few seconds to make sure it goes into tuning mode. And then you'll remove your screwdriver and put your head back into place and snap it back in. All right, so now it's in tuning mode. From here, You'll enter exactly two nickels, two dimes, two quarters, and two dollar coins. Um, starting with your nickels, you do it slowly. And then after I enter these two dollar coins, you'll hear the coin changer click. That means it's switched from tuning mode into teaching mode. So now we'll enter 20 of each of our coins and 4 of our dollar coins in order to teach it what the coins are supposed to be. So starting with our nickels and then your four dollar coins. Once you've inserted all your coins and your coin changer is accepting each type of coin, your coin mech is tuned. The next thing you'll do is disconnect the coin mech, unplug it, <clears throat> and then set your price to your desired amount. So I'm going to change the price back to 60. And now it's set at 60 cents. Replace the head, put it back into your machine, plug it in, and it's good to go.